Who doesn't love a spider plant? These charming little plants are easy to grow and produce spider wreaths off the ends of their stems. These babies can be divided from the parent plant and grown as a separate new plant. The spider plant is treasured for its pretty green foliage, its air purifying capabilities and its ease of maintenance. To thrive, they only need well-drained soil, indirect sunlight and moderate watering. If you meet these conditions, there is a good chance it will send off runners called stolons and produce baby plantlets called spiderets. Spider plants are excellent candidates for newbie gardeners or those without a green thumb as this plant needs no attention at all, just the right environment. As the daylight increases in spring, spider plants should begin producing flowers, eventually developing into babies or spider plant spiderets. The best way to propagate the plant is to cut the plantlet from the stolon with clean sharp scissors. Along the stolon of the mother plant, carefully remove the spider heads from the stolon. Do this by cutting right along their base. And here it is, my beautiful little four baby spider plants getting ready to start a fresh life. The basic checks before putting them into the process of propagation, cutting the bottom leaves and cleaning it. These plants can be easily propagated in water. Now placing the new cutting into the non-chlorinated water just deep enough to cover the very bottom of the spiderit. Keeping it under indirect sunlight and hoping it to root in 5 to 6 days. The process can be done over and over again to reward you with as many spider plants as you can handle and rest you can always give to people around you and encourage them to care for more greens. It's been a week now and it's time to check on these little buddies. Hello there tiny tots. The first one shows a very small rooting. Seems like it needs some more time under the shade. Oh, this seems to be an exciting one. The second spiderette spreading these beautiful white roots. The third one here has shown a good rooting as well. And the fourth one here needs a little more time. Isn't it so very exciting to see the new roots forming and making us believe that life happens so easily, the growing happens so beautifully. How just nurturing these plants make you so lively. Keep growing, keep planting.